Lee, present a speech with the title, When you are in heaven, don't leave your family in hell. When you're in heaven, don't leave your family in hell, try to leave. Ladies and gentlemen, do you know when a person passes away, all the estate will be frozen, include the cash in bank. And in order to unfreeze, actually we need to go to the court in order to get the order to unfreeze it. Let me share with you with one uh, artifice. From Sunday Times, 40 billion unclaimed cash and assets left by the debt. And from this 40 billion, 30 billion is in the land and property. It means the title in the land and property is still under the deceased name. Whereby, with that situation, the property cannot be transferred or sold to the other party. And 1.5 billion with register, register of unclaimed money, which include a cash in bank, shares, investments. So, and the next, you can see 70 million with EPF for those who are not doing any nominations or not update nominations. Like for example, an EPF member when maybe graduate, they nominate their parents as the nominees. But after some time, the parents have passed away and they forgot to update the nominations. So when these EPF members also pass away, in that case, it considers there is no nomination and we will fall back to the estate. It means the EPF money will be frozen. Once we fall back to the estate, it will be frozen. That's why you can see the figure 70 million with EPF cannot be withdrawn. So why this happens is because of sudden demise by a family member without leaving a will. A lot of people will say, well, you want me to do the estate planning that is doing the will? Not this time, uh, I'm not so fast to call bye-bye to the heavens, right? So, but as you see, the sudden demise is just an accident that you see, okay? So with that, without preparing, then the people not doing the uh, will, so this problems will be happen. So you might, I, I have another statistic to show that the statistic for the accidental death. This, this source is from internet. Statistic, statistic to show that the road accident death from 2000 to 2006. As you can see, in 2006, there is about 6,287 cases, means the people die in the road accident. Average, you can see that about 20 people is dying in the road every day. So, can we say that? No, la, actually, I'm, my, my long span is so, 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 so long because we really don't know when is the God will call us to the heaven, right? Okay, so, uh, and, then, and then another, some people might think that, well, doing estate planning, I, I only have small estate only. Doing estate planning only for those rich people like Michael Jackson, Anita Mui. Then I would like to show you another, another article from Star. Chris on joint account burdens living partner. I think every one of us, even though how poor are we, we also have some cash in bank, right? So this newspaper actually is showing that when a person passed away, even though you have joint accounts in the banks, but if let's say one of the account holder passed away and the other account holder would like to withdraw all the money and the bank actually do not allow it, even though it's a joint account. That's this newspaper show. So, ladies and gentlemen, then you might ask, just now, beginning, I, I say that when the uh, estate being frozen, so we need to get a court order in order to unfreeze the estate. Then you might ask, court order, how long to, to get this court order in order to unfreeze the estate? Well, it depends. If you have a will, and if you, without a will, there is a different timing. There is one, uh, according to one of the established uh, estate administration company, Rockville Trustee Company, they are the specialists who do the, this estate administrations. Means people who pass away and then they want uh, this kind of specialist in order to go to court to, to unfreeze the asset and then to speak to the beneficiary. So these are the professions, Rockville Trustee. According to them, they are saying that if a person without doing the will, 
So to, when pass away, you want to get the order from the court and up to the stage to distribute to the beneficiary, it takes about one to two years time. It means if there's still one to two years time, if all the estate will be frozen and you don't have other cash, and EPA family also cannot withdraw out because uh, the nomination is not updated, and also maybe no insurance. Because for information, for immediate cash to withdraw, which is not frozen, is only two things. That is EPF if you have a nomination, or insurance if you have a nomination. So these two things is, uh, with, that means that when passed away, it's not frozen one. Other than that, all frozen. So that's been with view, it takes about one to two years time. And without a will, it takes about two to five years according to the trustee. Maybe it's more if your asset uh, component is more complicated. And there is a story I would like to share with you. It's a story of my friends. At the age of 16, his father actually passed away due to an accident. And his father actually is a breadwinner. The mother is only a housewife. Can you imagine suddenly a breadwinner, just like a pillar in the house, just fall down? And all the family members don't know what to do. Withdraw the money, cannot frozen. So even though the funeral expenses also, also need to borrow from the relative in order to pay for the funeral expenses. And what about the home loan? You can guess the home loan cannot be settled and the house being options. And my friend, just at the age of 60, he had to stop studying in order to come up to work to support the family. Ladies and gentlemen, as my today my topic, when we are in heaven, don't leave our family in hell. That is the message to bring to you all today. So do a take an action if you we love your family to do a proper estate planning. If just in case one day we no longer with them to take care of themselves. Yes, back to you. Thank <laughs> you.